Hi, I'm Claudia Golden, Henry Lee Professor of Economics at Harvard University and author of Understanding the Gender Gap and the soon-to-be-published Career and Family, Women's Century-Long Journey Toward Equity. Why should they be held back? Simply because they are women. So how can we achieve gender equity? To have gender equity, we must achieve it in two spheres, the family and the marketplace. These are two sides of the same coin, couple equity and gender equality. Now, men and women start out their careers fairly equally after graduation from college or professional school, but their careers soon diverge. Women when they have children, tend to spend more time in childcare. Men tend to spend more time with their careers. But both lose. Women lose in terms of their careers, in terms of promotions and earnings, and men lose because they're not spending as much time with their children during those special moments. So the question is, why can't the couple do better? Why can't they split everything 50-50? And the answer is they could, but they would lose a fair amount of income. And the reason is, because work is fairly greedy, and the individual who puts in more hours and is on call gets monumentally more. But what about other factors that are often mentioned, such as discrimination, negotiation skills, managerial bias? These are clearly important, and it's important to level the playing field all over. But until we do something about greedy work, until we do something about the fact that workplace flexibility is expensive until we do something about the fact that women do more with their children, men do more with their careers. We're not going to achieve the two sides of the coin, which is couple equity and gender equality. Thank you very much.